Howdy, friends, and welcome to The Average J. Twinning. We are twinning today. <laughs> so it so is. Mine has a hood. Yeah, she has a hood. I don't. So subsequently, I did bring a winter hat because it's freezing. It's cold, and we're going for a walk. <laughs> yes, we are. Ran some errands yesterday. Behind me. Oh, that would be the chicken supplies. Supplies. Yep. Supplies. <laughs> we got um, the chicken food from Damagers. Uh, we've been using that for uh, about a month. Um, on the recommendation from Joan at Joan's Point of Plate. Um, and they, I mean, it, it really does well. They like it. But my egg production has still not gone up a lot. I went from four to five eggs a day. Now I'm about nine a day. So, I mean, there is increase. But um, but the chickies are getting old. They are. I, I think it has to do with their age, not their feed. Yeah. You know, but I when, I do give them, when I do give them scraps, they love oh, scraps. Yeah. You know, so... Or scramps, is the always <laughs> the old honey badger uh, video. Scramps. Oh, gosh, I haven't watched that in forever. <laughs> it has been a while, but <laughs> honey badger's done eating, and then it swoops in to pick up the scraps. Um, we are going to. We have a lot of errands today. We're going to try to go to uh, a thrift shop. Mm -hmm. We're going to try to first. We're going to go get Alex breakfast because <laughs> we're going to be going all day. Um, and I feel bad because Artie was not feeling good last night. He had a little the runs. The runs. So I think we just gave him too much table scraps. And so uh, dried dog food for three days. That's always going to get. And actually, he went this morning and it came out just fine. So hopefully it was just like a, a very short-term thing. But he ate my wubby. Yeah, he did. He ate, he ate her wubby. Get my wubby! Now look. Run, Jay! Run! Um, I, I haven't seen it come out yet, but <laughs> I mean, it's so small. I don't yeah. think it would take a whole lot to pass that, no. but, um, and then we're going to go down to ocean city, New Jersey, and that's where we will do our weekend walk. So walk the boards, walk the boards, but it's supposed to snow and then turn into rain. So we do have some heavy jackets, gloves. Oh, I have like four layers on multiple layers. <laughs> I don't have multiple layers. I might wind up being cold, but yeah, because it's breezy on the boardwalk. It is, but I can always Two cut. I can always cut the walk short. You could, <laughs> and just go eat pizza. Yes, and then we're going to go to Manco uh, and eat pizza. So come on along for the ride. <laughs> well, it is about seven thirty in the morning. It's actually seven forty now, and um, before we get on the road road, um, we had to make a quick stop for. McDonald's for our son Alex so because uh, I kind of feel bad we're leaving him he'll probably sleep most of the day anyway because he was up I think all night last night but we had to make a quick stop at Mickey D's for Alex we're at the thrift store and they're closed <laughs> I don't get it there's a sign on the door that says closed until further noticed I looked online this morning and it said they open at 7 a.m. even looking at it now it says open until 3 30 but there's a sign on the door on both doors actually that says closed until further notice boo boo right <laughs> and uh a young gentleman from my church uh trevor was just here two weeks ago three weeks ago and bought an accordion from them for like 40 bucks which is crazy you know <laughs> it's that's awesome you know and uh that was what kind of got me thinking to go here mm -hmm. And it's very disappointing that they are closed. So it is. It's right if, next to Cowtown. Yeah, right next to Cowtown. Can you see it back there? Oh, I'm trying to. Oh, I think I got a little bit of the cowboy, but <laughs> that's, that's Cowtown. <laughs> Cowtown. Uh, the rodeo is there, and um, they have a flea market on Saturdays. So, uh, but we weren't planning on going to the um, flea market. So, but. All right, so now we're going to settle in for next stop. <laughs> the next stop, an hour and 15 minute ride to the shore. However, this was 20 minutes out of our way, so mm -hmm. I'm kind of disappointed in that aspect too, but oh well, we'll jump on the road. But I will say, you know, two days ago it was like 66 degrees, you know, and today it's, I think I want to say this morning when I got up, it was like 24 mm -hmm. right now, looking at the thermostat, it's 29, mm -hmm. so... Boy, what a difference a day makes. Oh, it sure does. All right. So 
So we have made it to Ocean City and I told Jason, I said, you should show how, uh, you know, how the shoebies, or not, not shoebies, but how people who come down the shore for the summer stay. We're the shoebies. We are the shoebies. We're just here for the day. But if you were to rent or stay for the week, this is your typical street. Like, I think it's two streets off the beach. But, uh, they're nice. They're always building. Building another one. <laughs> They're update. I've seen them update a lot of these. All these big ones is yeah. where they take these little ones yeah. down. They take those little ones down yep. and they build these monster quadplex. Two stories. Yeah. Yeah. But they're nice. Yeah. We, but we stayed in one. I like the year. charm of the little ones. They are. All right. We'll see you on the boardwalk. All right. We parked. And one nice thing is like this lot normally during season you can't even find a spot in here and it's twenty dollars to park mm -hmm. but during the winter time it's free yay, yay. Fr free's a good one so <laughs> um i want to clarify real quick when michelle said the word shuby uh -huh. so uh, what a shuby is so anybody who um you know rented a place down here or whatever or owned a place you know they were you know regular visitors but vacationers, ba vacationers. <laughs> but back in the day people used to come from the city on day trips they would literally just come for one day and they would pack their lunch in an old shoe box and that's why they were called shoebies because they had their day lunch in a shoe box that they would eat on the beach for the day and there's a term called shooby feet so during a lot of people when they're down here during the summertime walk around barefoot you know and you kind of build up a tolerance for hot sand hot asphalt or roughness or whatever but the shoebies you know they're they're used to wearing shoes all the time so <laughs> you know when they would take their shoes off you know they'd be walking the sands oh oh it's hot it's hot uh, shooby feet so <laughs> that is the term shooby but we're gonna go ahead and go up on the boardwalk and uh we'll show, show, oh did you show over there show what we're, we're right here by Mexico. oh yeah so Mexico, Mexico. there is the boardwalks up there and right there is Manco and Manco Pizza, that's where we're going to eat. So, you know, we're parked right when, once we're all full, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. Once we're full, we don't have far to walk. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Although, I got to say, it felt good to get out of the car. My legs were stiff. Yeah. Well, we've been in it since 7.30. 7, yeah. So. <laughs> and it's 9.30-ish. Right. It's uh, 9.30. Yeah. yeah. Right now, it's 9.30. But uh, let's head up on the boards. Okay. Manco and Manco, we'll be back for them, but... Not many people up on here. During the summertime, this thing will be completely packed. The ocean looks pretty calm. There's the music pier. And all the little shops. Shriver's Fudge looks like it's open. Yeah, they got Easter candy. Oh, Easter candy. Okay, okay. So Michelle and I are going to walk down uh, this direction. Um, eventually you can see at the end, you know, the shops do end, but the boardwalk continues for like another, I want to say half a mile past that. So we're going to walk all the way down to the end, hopefully, and back. I would, I would film. I would film. film what? The, some of the shops. Some of the shops? All right. We'll show you some of the stuff as we go. I mean, there's a lot of everything. A mirror maze. Johnson's popcorn is the best caramel popcorn you'll ever have. There's actually two of them up on the boardwalk. One's up here and there's one back down the other way. Mini golf, a lot of food places. Core Brothers ice cream. I'm trying to remember, did you say you do or don't like Core Brothers? I, I want to say I've never had it, honey. I think you did. <laughs> mm -hmm. Nice lifeguard truck. You know, I have never used one of these down here at the shore. I've used them in the cities before, but never here. But this is at the end of the music pier. They do, on the boardwalk, have a little water park with some water slides. It's not quite Volcano Bay at Universal, but I mean, uh, it's what they have. 
I do stand corrected. I said that there were two Johnson's popcorns on the boardwalk. There's actually three. Yeah, so this is the third. Three boardwalk locations. So, old time photos where you can make it like the old West photo. And up here is Wonderland, which is like obviously the Ferris wheel is a giveaway. This is where like they have the kids rides. And look, another mini golf. Oh my. <laughs> so Michelle is standing in front of the Taylor pork roll sign. So for all those people that say, you know, I, doesn't Joan call it Taylor ham? I think but anyway um, for those that call it Taylor ham Taylor itself sign says Taylor pork roll <laughs> I will say the visibility is very good because if you look way in the background you can see Atlantic City so from Ocean City to Atlantic City I'm not quite sure how many miles it is but there is very very good visibility all those casinos Taking people's money. Taking people's money. That's it. Well, I think uh, Joan and Doug from Joan's Point of Plate and the boys went to Hell's Kitchen that they just opened. Oh, okay. That day, so. That's cool. I would like to go there. We are approaching the, I guess it's the Ocean City Beach Patrol building under headquarters what's the, that the headquarters i would say where's mitch where's mitch from baywatch <laughs> <laughs> he's with cj he's with cj and all the rest of them <laughs> all right i'm getting michelle for the first time ever going to the end of the line Sidewalk. What's at the end of the boardwalk? What's at the end of the boardwalk? <laughs> Nothing. This is the end of the Ocean City boardwalk. That's it. it. You've done it. Yeah, you're like doing your Rocky dance. <laughs> so we walk down off the boardwalk for just a minute, and you know my favorite princess is Ariel. And look, she came to visit. She's in the bush. <laughs> that is so funny. <laughs> Michelle's fave. <laughs> she is. So it looks like they're doing the front of this um, area again. I showed you Wonderland at the end of the pier, but this is the other section. I want to say it was Jillian's maybe? Jillian's Pier or something, but yeah, you know, they have a roller coaster and the double shot. I'll never forget the double shot. See, they, well, no, they filmed um, It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia, their episode down the shore. And there was a scene where she got her hair caught in the machine and he vomited. It was so funny. Oh, that's really in there. Oh, you had him! Shut the fuck up, So I was wrong, it's not Jillian's Pier, it's Playland's Castaway Cove. That's what it is where the other rides are. So I do find it kind of funny that uh, this is a candy store that we never saw before, but look how they put the Disney-ish um, kind of lettering on and have Mickey Mouse uh, stuffy in the front. <laughs> wonder how, uh, wonder how the folks at Disney feel about that copyright stuff, huh? <laughs> so this is the third Johnson's popcorn location. This is the one that's open all year round. This is also like the gift shop. The other ones you just get the caramel popcorn, but this one has like all the gift baskets and stuff like that. But Michelle says she wanted some, right? Yes. All right, let's go get it. And this is where they make the magic. All in the kettles. Yep. Let me just tell you, the smell is wonderful. Yeah, it's too bad that you can't get smell over video, you know? So here, Michelle, take that. Sorry.
So, you know, I got my little cup and I'm coming out here, but I'm trying to eat it before it gets cold because it's so nice and warm and melty and caramely goodness. <laughs> awesome. All right, so on top of the, it's a mini golf, like a medieval fantasy mini golf, but you know, they have their wizard and I'm gonna show you right here who it reminds me of. <laughs> you shall not pass! We are in Shrivers and this is where they make salt water taffy. Pretty cool. 30, 325 pieces of mint a minute. Wow. So we made it in here. Where are we? Manco and Manco. Manco and Manco. So this is our favorite place. We are first ones in. <laughs> What's that? We are the first ones in too. Yeah, they open like, at 1130. I think we did a YouTube. I think I was wearing the sweatshirt too. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Well, but yeah, I mean, it's really nice in here. This is the one that's open all year round. <laughs> so here we go. Michelle is chowing down on the Manco and Manco pizza. This is the real deal. And it is steaming, burning hot. Mm -hmm. You're going to burn your mouth. <laughs> hey, honey. Is this Weight Watchers friendly? Uh, yeah. <laughs> About a hundred points. <laughs> All right, we are done eating our pizza and we have leftovers Leftovers for Alex. <laughs> so again, there's the sign, Manco and Manco. And uh, now we're gonna go get some candy. Yum. Turn around, turn around. Oh yeah, <laughs> the, the place we're getting candy it is, is right, right behind us. <laughs> so we only rented a house one time and it's this one right here with the flat top roof. We were on the bottom floor and uh, it looks like they're doing some work on it, doing a whole remodel. So. Uh, but that is the only time that we ever rented a house for a week by ourselves. Um, it was, I remember exactly what year. I just remember it was 100 degrees in the shade in the month of July. And um, the air conditioner in our vehicle, we had a Chrysler minivan, minivan Chrysler minivan. And uh, the air conditioner went out like days before we came down. I didn't have time to get it fixed. And uh, for the whole week for vacation, we were uh, dying of heat. And how was the ride home when we were oh, riding home? It was awful. We were all like lethargic and he was having a tough time staying awake. We had to stop like coming home because yeah. couldn't keep my eyes open. It was so, so hot. hot. I know. So the other house that I stayed in down in Ocean City is this one directly across the street. The brown one with the round room whatever um my aunt uh my aunt rena my mom's sister had rented that house and we were fortunate enough to be able to come down and stay i'm just trying to get this on the car as you can see it is starting to snow a little bit which is just weird. They're neat little flakes though. Look at this. Yeah, I know. They're like a little sleep. <laughs> but yeah, it's kind of like icy. You got some on your jacket. It's uh, so funny. Oh, you got a really neat one on your... Very cool. <laughs> just so weird seeing snow. Stopped at the Wawa to get some uh, coffee. See, got my coffee right here. <laughs> Last stop on Memory Lane. So this is Bayberry Cove. Um, it's like a mobile park, mobile trailer park, you know. So they don't go anywhere. They're permanently installed. I think the wheels are all taken off of them. They put skirting around it, decks and everything. So um, I don't think I have a picture of it. Uh, of where we used to stay, but it was a 240 Egret Lane was the address. But it used to be like uh, open May or April through October, I think. And uh, you could get in on the weekends like the month before and after. But I, I got to say, they did put like a big gate up 
um, near the guardhouse. That gate was never there. So you can't get in or anything, but that was it. All right, we made another quick stop. Where are we? Lidl. Had to I, stop. Needed, I needed my lemon bars. Yeah. This is her favorite fiber lemon bars yes. that she eats when she's uh, she not, to diet. not not diet. She's trying to cut back. Yeah. But um, if you want to watch our full Lidl tour, I'll link that down below. Made it back to the house eight hours later. <laughs> We're done our shift for the day. We put in a full it's Miller time. <laughs> it's Miller time. That's right. So <laughs> it's three thirty. It's, it's actually Chinese food Chinese time. food time. We thought they got Chinese food because it's already three thirty. We ate the pizza at eleven thirty, so it's been four hours. Marty left the window. He was yeah. in the window. He saw. He popped his. He must have been laying on the floor. He popped his head up. What's that? But ears went up and he ran. Got so we know as soon as we walk in, he's gonna gank us. You know that's that's what we call it when he just won't let you alone and just jumps on you. People are home. My peoples are home, so <laughs> that I can hear them barking now. Yep. So, but that was our day. Uh, closed thrift store, uh, thrift store. Boo! Long ride down to the shore, freezing cold up on the boardwalk. I, like a dummy, didn't take my. I wore my baseball hat, and not my other hat that covers my ears, and my ears were freezing. We wound up walking three miles. That was pretty good. So I earned my manco manco. You earned your, you earned your manco yeah. man, manco and manco, and we did bring some home for Alex. And, um, oh, we also got him a little chocolate. Alex loves cats, so we got him a chocolate cat. I'll insert a picture right here. And uh, that was from the... Uh, Shrivers. Shrivers, so... Uh, well, you can get anything. Yeah. But that was the day. We appreciate you watching. If you get a chance, like and subscribe. Have a great day. <laughs> Bye.